Hi everybody, I'm uber excited. My Walmart box just came in, so I'm coming to you with a almost fresh face. I didn't take all of my eye makeup off yesterday. Let's see if I can get the camera to focus on me. Where are you going? Well, it just wants to think I'm a ghost. I think it's this light up here. Hold on. Alright, give you a minute to just... And nope. Not happening. What if we do this one over here? Can we get a better picture? A little bit better. I start to see some shadow of my nose. Not much, though. There we go. Okay. So, my Walmart box is in, and I am so excited. It looks super pretty. It looks like somebody, looks like wrapping paper. Now, I did go ahead and take the plastic off, but I have not looked inside. And that's why I'm coming to you with no makeup. Because I'm so excited to see what is in my box that I don't want to wait for me. <laughs> Which is unusual. So, let's open it up, and it looks like purple paper this time. A little card on the top. So, Walmart Beauty Box. Have you covered all year long? Oh, let's do this real quick. Pause. Turn over a new leaf with the latest looks from your favorite beauty brands. Remember to keep your look fresh by visiting your local Walmart. And then it just has their social media. So, ooh, ooh. okay. First thing I see here, I absolutely adore, and it is so good to get a travel size. It is the Batiste. dry shampoo. Now, I really like the way they did the uh, packaging. They've changed it a little bit, and I'll get my bottle. Okay, this is the regular bottle of Batiste. Oh, I just had you zoomed in. Okay, and then this is the sample size. So, as you can see, they did change up the bottle a little bit for the sample size. Honestly, I really like the way they did the packaging on here. And they both are clean and classic original scent, which is my favorite. It has kind of a baby powdery scent, and I, I like that. If you don't like that, you're not going to like this scent, scent, but I am conf confident you will still like the shampoo. Okay, the next thing in here is Village Naturals Therapy Aches and Pains Muscle Relief Concentrated Bath Soap in Eucalyptic Spearmint and Menthol. Eucalyptus. And it looks like that. Now, I buy these little containers at the Dollar Tree, um, and a lot of people hate these packets. Well, I'll get these packets, and then I'll put them in those little things at the Dollar Tree and it doesn't bother me. Little packets don't bother me. Um, sometimes if I've got more than one packet of the same shampoo, I'll do that as well. Oh, I'm so excited for the next one. Cleaning Clear Deep Action 60 Second Shower Mask. So you do this in the shower. Um, let me think. You do it in the shower and the steam and stuff from your shower is supposed to activate it, I do believe. Yeah, steam activated, refreshing, deep clean. The mask works with the steam of your shower to deeply but gently exfoliate. Exfoliate? Is exfoliate a word? I don't like so. Exfoliate away traces of dirt, oil, and dead skin that can clog pores. In just 60 seconds, your skin will look and feel refreshed can be used alone or right after your favorite face cleansing. And it's completely oil free. So I like that because sometimes my face can be oiled. Most of the time it's just combination. 
Ooh. Dove Purely Pampering Nurturing Nutritioning Body Wash in Sweet Cream and Peony. So that's that. It's got such a light picture at the bottom. <laughs> kind of reminds me of a lotion. Ooh. Or like a conditioner looking thing. So it does, it has a very, very floral scent. So if you don't like a floral scent, you're not going to like this. But it does have a floral scent. I kind of like it. The next thing is the Cetaphil Moisture Cream. Dry, sensitive skin, intense moisture for long-lasting hydration. And it is fragrance-free. I have a son that just uses the heck out of these things. Just any kind of little sample of lotion. It's his and it's gone within a couple days. So it doesn't really have a scent. Kind of that no scent scent, you know, kind of a little uh, cosmetic y but not in a bad way. And it seems to be fading. The next thing in my box is the Naturally Friendly Hello Pure Mint. What is this? Oh, Extra Whitening Fluoride Toothpaste. So that's what it looks like. It says hello. And let's see. Wasn't that cute? Now, see, somebody in my house would so grab that, thinking it was like hair gel or something else. And this could be absolutely funny. Just incredibly funny. So it says hello right on it. That's cute. Toothpaste that doesn't look like toothpaste. I see some trouble. Okay, the next thing in here I love. It is the Biore Charcoal Pore Slip Strips. And I do like the way these work. And it's uh, C3 times less oil. Now, I would like to go ahead and get... I've gotten a few samples of these in different things. And I would like to go ahead and get the full size. I just haven't had time to do it. The last sample I got did not give me a coupon. Does this one? Does not look like it. I love when they include coupons. There may still be one. I just haven't gotten to it yet. The next thing in my box is from Eco Tools. And it is, oh, a single pack makeup brush cleansing cloth. A simple daily cleanse for your makeup brushes. So, I'm guessing it kind of looks like a makeup wipe or, you know, a baby butt wipe or something. That's what it kind of feels like in there. And you just rub it around on there. It looks like the last thing in my box. Oh, no. The next to last thing in my box is a sample of Nature's Bounty Hair, Skin, and Nails Gummies. And let's see. Okay. Serving size, two gummies. Servings per container, one. 15 calories, three grams of carbs, two grams of sugars, uh, 15 milligrams of vitamin C. Vitamin E is 15. Biotin, 2,500 2, MCG. Sodium, ooh, there's 10 milligrams of sodium in these. It's a lot of sodium in. Not used to sodium in my, uh, anything. Anything medical related. I take a multivitamin, which I haven't taken today. Okay, they're really, like, squishy squishy like shiny squishy
They taste like a Starburst gummy. Yeah, they taste like the little Starburst gummies. They're really good. Oh, wait. They've kind of got an aftertaste to them. Not exactly horrible, but kind of like a... A bitter... Almost like a bitter citrus, but not a bad bitter citrus. So that's nice. And then we have some kind of book with a coupon on the back. A dollar off coupon for the Hello mouthwash. And it says, meet your new squeeze. Um, we're on a mission to have the world, the world a friendlier place. Let me turn, put it towards me. We're on a mission to make the world a friendlier place, starting with your mouth. Say hello to oral care that's effective, delicious, and beautiful, and as natural as we can make it. And then it says reasons to love hello. It has those on the bottom. Taste buds, planet, digestion, health, and people. And then it says where the magic begins. Hello, Mintfield in Wilmot Valley, Oregon. I think that's how you pronounce that. Nice little we'll field. And my laptop is... I need to get a camera or something so I can go where I want when I want. It's not like you can't take my laptop there, but the laptop's so wiggly. Let's see. Our thoughtful ingredients... Sorbitol, sorbitol, a humicant and sweetener that le lends a variety of texture to the paste. And let's face it, once you go velvety with your paste, there's no going back. And it shows a picture of corn on top of that. And then purified water, hydrated silica. Polishes teeth and removes stains based on your favorite dry cleanser. I have no idea what hydrated silica is. When I think of silica, I think of the little silicate packets you put in your shoes or purses and stuff. Glycerin. Sustainably sourced oil from canola. canola. Coconuts palm produce glycerin that enhances mouthfeel and acts as a moisturizer and a well moisturized mouth is a happy mouth and then it says stevia so it does have stevia I, I know some people can't have that our responsibility and sustainability formed farmed stevia is a natural near zero calorie sweetener that doesn't promote cavities cavities and calories are seriously unfriendly and it just goes on. I'll give you the next page. Get it in focus. So if you would like to read the rest, you can. And then the top page. And you can just pause where you want to. And then it says, no. As a friendly company, this is our least favorite word. But sometimes you've got to say it. No dyes, no parabens, no artificial sweeteners, no triclosin, no triclosin, no triclosin, no microbeads. So whatever that word is right there. Don't know, so I probably butchered it, but that's okay. And then it's a picture of whoever Zoe is brushing her teeth. And it says, hi. Uh, hello, kiddo. Kids comes in bubble gum and blue raspberry. Fluoride-free fluoride and SLS-free paste for kids of all ages. And that, this is watermelon on that page. Uh... 
Meet your new squeeze. Spearmint, Mojito Mint. Not sure how that's going to taste. Pure Mint. And then you'll develop a crush on your brush seriously. And then it says, 86% agree after using Hello Toothpaste, my mouth feels super clean and fresh. 74% agree with the statement, I look forward to brushing my teeth more than I did. 71% agree Hello Toothpaste is the best tasting toothpaste I've ever had. 97% agree with the statement, I love seeing the colorful Hello Tubes on my bathroom counter every morning. See, I don't keep mine on my bathroom counter. Them suckers are put away. 96% agree Hello Toothpaste feels gentle and doesn't irritate teeth and gums. So, I did not see where it said it had one for sensitive teeth. I got the one for whitening in pure mint. So, I'm going to give it a sniffy sniff. I may give it a tasty taste. Okay, it does come with one of my favorite things that companies put on there. Let me get it. See, there is the little tab. Gee, I'm going to open toothpaste while we're eating my teeth. Kind of. Mm -hmm. Kind of reminds me of a minty Play-Doh. That's what the product looks like. Hmm. Okay. It tastes kind of like a... Um, Sweetened, just a sweetened, like, icebreaker. If icebreaker was just a little bit more sweet, that's kind of what it, it tastes like. So, this is an incredible box this month. I mean, we got deluxe size one, two, three, four. Am I missing anything? We got four big samples. I'm missing a lotion. Am I? No. Okay. We got four big, big size samples. And I guess that can be considered one as well. And then we got three of the one use sample trials. So, or I guess you would call these travel size. And then actual sample size. So that was an extremely good box this month. I mean, well over five bucks. I think these are like a dollar fifty. I'd have to give since it's a specialty thing and it's supposed to look pretty. It's probably about two dollars. These I know are like two dollars in the store. Mm, this uh, they'd probably put three dollars on so it's over five dollars worth to me it's over five dollars worth of product now I do pay for this box they don't send me this box for review I doubt they even realize I review this box on YouTube um, I pay for it out of my own pocket and I'm super excited about the box it's just it's so cute and different from the usual white. I wonder if they're going to continue to do a themed box on the outside. That'll be nice to know. I guess we'll have to wait till winter. So a whole nother season. But I think they do it summer, fall, and winter. But I'm not 100% sure. It is $5 a month. So well worth the price. Uh, 
I'm hoping I'll be able to snag the Target Beauty Box this month for next month. We'll see. Anyways, I love you guys so much. And I will, t I will see you again.